Dearly beloved, greetings in the name of Jesus. How are you all? Today did you speak with Lord God? Did you meditate on the scripture? Did Jesus speak with you? To walk with him, we need to give some time to him, right? To speak to him, we need to read his word. You need to read the Bible without fail and speak with God. You need to pay attention to what he says. Even today, he wants to speak with you through his word. You know what it is in Job chapter 17 and verse 9. And he who has clean hands will be stronger and stronger. You have to become stronger and stronger. You must reach higher and higher. You should be blessed more and more. You must win more and more. This is God's wish. God desires for you to become stronger and stronger. For that he says one thing that is, he who has clean hands, our hands must be clean. We should not sin without our hands. We should not do things that grieve and agonize God. We should not sin at all. How many sins do we commit with these hands? Think about it. We extend our hands to take bribes, to do illegal businesses, to adulterate and create social evils. We use them to write complaints about others. And we use our hands to do many other wrong things like that. These hands need to be clean. You need to commit yourself to keep your hands clean always. I will not do sinful things with these hands. With them we reach out for alcohol, hold cigarettes and crush drugs and put them in our mouth. What all we use? our hands fall but if we have clean hands god will surely bless and raise us we need to commit ourselves to keep our hands free from things that don't please god if we commit ourselves god will do miracles you will be able to see it my dearly beloved to purify our hands jesus allowed his hands to be nailed they put nails in his hands right he allowed his hands to be nailed on the cross of calvary that blood of Jesus Christ has power. It purifies our hands of the sins we have committed with our hands. If we commit our hands to His blood daily, the power of His blood will keep our hands without sin and blemish. So what you need to do for your hands to get purified is, you need to pray like this saying, Dear Lord, I need to have clean hands. I should not touch or do anything that doesn't please you with these hands. I commit myself to keep myself without sin. Will you say like this? Dear Lord, I commit my hands to holiness. Please wash the sins committed by these hands to this day with the blood that flowed from your hands. Dear Lord, keep me from sinning with these hands. Keep me from doing injustice with these hands. Protect and guide my hands with the power of your blood. I pray this prayer in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.